In the 1950s, an Italian painter, Giovanni Bragolin, painted a series of portraits, all of crying children. At first glance, they seem innocent, but in the shadows of these tearful faces lies a sinister legend that has terrified generations. This is the story of the crying boy. On September 5, 1985, the British tabloid The Sun published a chilling story. An Essex firefighter claimed to have found undamaged copies of The Crying Boy amidst the charred ruins of burnt houses. Word spread like wildfire. By November, fear of the painting's curse grew so intense that people began sending their own copies to the sun to be burned. Enter British writer and comedian Steve Punt. In 2010, he investigated the curse for BBC Radio 4's show Punt P.I. His research led him to the building research establishment. The verdict? The painting's varnish, treated with fire-retardant chemicals, could explain why it remained untouched. A plausible explanation, it would seem. But in time, it would become... questionable. Quite questionable, indeed. Sure, fire-retardant varnish could be the answer in one or two cases, perhaps even twenty, but there were many more paintings, with their own stories to tell. Firefighters reported seeing the painting unharmed in the ruins of many mysterious fires across England. Families like the Halls, who sought to disprove the curse, found their homes burnt to ashes, all except for the painting. Was it mere superstition or a real-life curse? One woman from Leeds destroyed her painting only to lose her husband and sons in a fire soon after. The tragic tales kept coming and the terror spread like, well, tears in a river. Yet not everyone believed. Journalist David Clark dismissed the stories, saying the names and events linking the painting to fires were fabricated. Stories about Don Bonillo, the so-called devil child, were mere fiction, he argued. But could all these events just be coincidence? Or was there more at play? To this day, the crying boy hangs on walls worldwide. Some believe it to be cursed, a icon of doom. Others dismiss it as nothing more than harmless art. But one thing is certain, its reputation as the cursed painting will continue to haunt us, as long as those tear-filled eyes look back at us from the shadows. Thank you for watching, like, share, and subscribe and check out the video slit in the scary creepy playlist. I think you will find it quite chilling.